Alright guys, this review is about, bam, Samsung Buds Plus. So this is the Buds Plus, the latest one. I got the blues. I, I now, I've seen these in, in the videos and stuff like that. I didn't think it would be that good. Okay, now we're going to do a whole full review. We're going to go into the settings everything. But first we're going to do the unboxing on these guys right there. Okay, first you got the box. Of course you got the radio. You know, user manual or whatever is this in I don't know, I guess user manual in there, whatever that is. Then of course you got the got the charging port, type C cable right there. And then you got all these uh, accessories to it. I'm gonna explain these accessories in a minute. In this case got the port and got the rubber accessories to it, but let's let's open these guys right there. Ooh look at that. Bam! Now is that nice or what? Look at that. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see how shiny this is, but whoa, look at that. Looks like a beetle. It's like super shiny. Looks like a beetle. All right, let, let's just get into it. Okay. So I already kind of activated these already. Okay, these are what it looks like. Now, the thing about these is um, you see this rubber part that goes around right there? Now, I went with the flat ones because it makes it more smaller, but they have these ones right here. Notice how the ends right here like stick out a little bit right there. Now um, this might be more comfortable for some of you guys, but I just didn't like it because it made it a little bit bigger. There's this one and there's one more that sticks a little bit more out. But I wanted the, this one because it's a pure flat one right here. It's like a nice flat surface right around it. You know, I don't even think you need these rubber things, but I think this is mostly for grip, so I don't need this part. But well, I guess I can show you the other piece that goes with it. Here we go. So, that's the same one, huh? Hold on, hold on. Here we go. Of course, you got, you know, these right here for your ears and stuff. You got like three different sizes of these guys right here, but I just want to show you this part. Okay, you see how these are sticking out? Okay, this one sticks out a little bit more than that one. I don't know if you guys can see, like, there's a, like a slight difference. And then... The one I got on this one doesn't have that angle edge at it at all. Because, yeah, I didn't want to. Personally I, personally, I think it looked kind of stupid on it. But look at that. Look how smooth it looks without it. Now, by default, it comes with the biggest one on, like this. Like, you're supposed to have it like it's mandatory. But it's not. Keep in mind, it's in the packet. So, if you get this small one right there. Well, I call it the small one because it makes this thing look sweet. Look at that. Look how cool it looks without this. All right. Let's put this back in there. So again, I'm just bear with me, we did a 100% full review. So we did the unboxing. Like I said, we got the power cable. We got the rubber thingies that go with it. I'm trying to keep everything together because I just got these. Just in case something goes wrong, I'm gonna return it. Put this back in the box right here. All right. Now we're gonna examine the case right here. Put these down right here. Okay, this is the case right here. Full review on the case. Look how smooth this looks. This thing is awesome. Now keep in mind the inside ain't rubber, it's like a hard plastic, but like a mate finish. But the outside is super glossy and shiny, I like that. I wish it put a rubber part down here though, because th these are kind of slippery, but like on a slippery surface, it would slide off the table, whatever. I really wish it put rubber, but you know, I can always put a, my own rubber on there anyway, I'll probably do that eventually. But um, there's your cable part right there. There's like a little light on them, you can see it, a little tiny light right there. Tells you when you're charging or whatever. Now, if I'm not mistaken, I could be wrong because I just got these. It has a power battery inside built in this. But I think it's just for one charge. I'm not sure. Because I see this thing blinking and it's not even plugged in. So I think it tr there's a battery pack built in this. So, put this in here. Yeah, this is the part that sucks. I keep getting the right mix with the left and left mix with the right, whatever. I'm just going to put this back in there. These fit nicely back in there. I think this has, yeah, it's magnetic. So you don't have to worry about moving around. That's what it looks like inside there. Bam. This is going to be a little bit long review, guys. So if you don't mind, just bear with me. All right. So we're going to zoom in on this a little bit. Okay. I just want to show you guys the dimensions. In case you guys want to get like a case or something for it before you purchase it. All right. Looks like a pill, doesn't it? <laughs> so here, this is the dimensions right here. A little less than three inches going that way. And then across here, I think two little less than 
into well yeah well inner areas are dirty areas about an inch and a half almost that's the dimensions of it and for these guys these guys are so tiny they actually look like a hernia when you have them on <laughs> but the blue is so awesome though I love that shine look at that so this whole thing basically is just a mate finish in blue all mate and then down is this super shiny like a nice super shiny gloss like a beetle it looks exactly like a beetle bug or something Okay, let's just get measurements. Let's just try to get into this real fast. I want to keep you guys. So one inch this way. Let me put it more straight. About an inch that way. Remember, I got this earpiece on. And then this way, about uh, almost half an inch. A little more than a little more than half an inch. That's how small they are. All right, let's put these away. Now we're gonna do the software review. Let me just zoom out. The software was super easy. Super easy. To learn. I just want to show you like. You know, if you guys just want an easier comparison right there, this is a business card, and that's how smart these guys are. Like I said, they're like hearing aids. So these are awesome. And I like the indicator right there too. So, I don't know, because you see the bottom? Well, I, you guys can't even see the words on the bottom, but there's like these little words on the bottom. So I want to find out like if this battery is just for one charge for the headphones or, or what. But yeah, it's a built-in battery pack. It's not that heavy it's kind of light but has some weight to it a little bit like maybe like yeah I don't know has has some weight to it real little though not too bad all right let me put this back just in case I it might be defective later who knows might have to take it back might not I don't know you may never know but that right there all right let's go into the software it's my phone right here just the gel it's a gel um backing I got basically it's like a sticker you put on to protect your phone and this thing is pretty awesome. I got it from decalgel.com. Decalgel.com. And this thing is basically like a gel protector, like a screen protector. See, I have a screen protector on here, like a gel screen protector. And then this back, you can put any design, you can make your own design, whatever it gets back. But we're not here to talk about this crap. We're here to talk about these guys, right? All right, let's get into it. Let's put this guy right here. I'm trying to make my video as classy as possible. Bam! All right, let's get into it. Now, I don't know if you guys can see this. Let me zoom in a little bit. Bam. Sorry, I'm super excited about these earbuds because I've been wanting, you know, these guys for a while. And I didn't, this is like my last electronic I got was like this watch right here. That's my last electronic I got. And that's my new face I made, custom made face. I made it myself. Check out my videos on it. I can turn it into a Rolex or whatever you want. The bezel on it, whatever. Well, anyways, it's the active Samsung Galaxy Active 2 LTE version. Let's get into this. Sorry. Like I said, it's going to be a pretty long video because I'm kind of excited. I haven't been on this thing for a while. My home screener. First thing you want to do, number one thing, everybody is complaining that, oh, it sounds awesome. It's one of the best that they heard, but there's no bass. Like, what do you mean there's no bass? It, this phone is like a computer. Okay. You can download an app, you can download whatever to boost up the bass. So keep that in mind. So for me, I have the Note 10 Plus, Samsung Galaxy Note 10 Plus. So uh, this is the secret. This is how you just boost up the bass. Okay, so you go here, you go straight to your settings. I'm not sure what phone you might have, but I'm on the Note 10. So you go down here, you go straight. All you gotta do is just go straight, boom. It sounds right there. Then right here, sound quality and effects. Okay, this is what mine comes with. Now remember, you can download apps or whatever to boost up the bass or whatever you want. But to me, it sounds good without the bass. Like, it already has bass, but people are saying it doesn't, but it has a lot of bass. But I don't know, people complaining. So for me, I click that, sound quality and effects. Check this out. Adobe surround sound on my Note 10 Plus right there. I got these two check. It gives a total surround sound. Okay, this one you can't click. This is my gaming one. But this one, it allows you to click it and choose options. Now for me, I'm keeping it on auto because audio auto seems to recognize what I'm doing. Movie, gaming, voice, music, whatever. You can just keep it straight on music if you want. But I do like everything on this, so I just keep it on auto right now. And check this out. This is your surround sound. This is your bass right here. You can easily download an app that can boost bass. But like I said, these things has 100% bass. 
base on them already so I'm not sure why people are complaining could be the phone model that they have is not good enough or something but you, all you got to do is simply see when you open it it pops up automatically you see that now that's cool so what I want to do is right here you can pick pop classic jazz rock this is my custom one if you want full bass I tried it this is how much bass it had I thought I would have blown it or something but the bass quality is amazing on this if you got it loud or soft but bam so what I like to do is you can boost this up I like to put these up like that put this a little up this right there like right around there you want this the main thing is you want the bass up and you got the treble right there so this was my default but I didn't like it because it over was way way too much bass for me I mean it's a lot of bass a lot of bass trust me you don't really need this but if you want you can like I said you can do it straight on your phone or you can just download a software like an app you know what they say there's always an app of that so whether you got the Android Apple whatever doesn't matter it's going to the phone settings if, and so like I said this one has Adobe surround sound and all that so now we're going into the app of this guy so you have to download sorry get back here Oh, I got everything mixed up. There we go. Okay, this one is called Galaxy Rarible. You got down on Galaxy Rarible to use it on any device, whatever device you got, whatever phone you got. I mean, you know what I mean? You click that, whether you got a phone or a tablet, whatever. And okay, this is going to pop up for me because right now I'm showing my watch. And yes, you can have your earbuds and your watch connected at the same exact time. You don't have to worry nothing about that at all. You can connect both of these guys at the same time. No problem. So to connect these, again, bam, activated. That's it, that's all you gotta do. Just gotta open them. You can take them out if you want, put them on the side. Go down here, sorry, gotta get out of here again. Boom, right there. So that's the battery left on these guys right there. Now it can tell the battery of each one, like if one's 50%, if one's 90%, it can do that too. But right now I just got it on default because I just got these three. Now I'm, I'm going to tell you some cool things about it. I mean, I just did the software in 10 minutes. It's real super basic. Okay, adopt sound. A lot of people don't know that. Oh, sorry, adopt sound. How? I can't even talk right. That's not adopt sound. But <laughs> but anyway, when you click this, you have the lowest to the highest volume. Okay, a lot of you guys don't know these can turn into hearing aids. If you have a hard time hearing and you want to listen to music, this is the perfect thing because these things are like hearing aids on top of that. So that's the cool thing about this. You can turn this into a hearing aid. But of course, I don't have trouble hearing so I turned it off, but it's pretty pretty cool. Or you can have it like as an enhancer, like people wouldn't think you can hear what they're saying or whatever. But most of the time, they wouldn't even know if you got this because it's small like a hearing aid too. Now for this sound part right here, Again, I got Adobe Surround already on, but you can go normal, bass, you know, bass boost, soft, clear, turbo. But me, I like this one because with this one, it gives a hundred percent surround sound on top of that. So it's Adobe Surround sound with that surround sound. So to me, for people who love surround sound, even if you don't have Adobe, that's surround sound right there, hundred percent awesome surround sound sweet okay then on here you got oh this is another feature I activated this thing I didn't know what it was okay it tells you exactly what you got if you got a text message it'll tell you exactly you got a text message you got an email it will say you got an email you got a voicemail say you got a voicemail it's it's awesome or you can even have it like tell you exactly who's calling whatever but this is awesome and I have mine connected with Bixby right now too, which is more awesome because I can just say make a phone call, whatever, without dialing. But we'll get back to that later. Okay, then you got the touchpad. So this is the reason why this, well, the shiny part right here, the reason why I made this part shiny is because that's for you to know that's your touch. You touch this to do a bunch of setups, features, whatever. You have to touch that. The programming is real basic. You can I got mine to Bixby, like I said, but you can have it go to the sound. You can have it go volume. So this can be like up volume. This can be a down volume, whatever. But me, I like to full Bixby because I want to make phone calls, 
mm, schedules, whatever, whatever. Bixby can do a whole bunch of stuff. Go back here. And then this thing features pretty cool. I never really tried this yet. Okay, it's find my earbuds. Left or right. I never tried it. I'm afraid it might blow it or something. <laughs> I don't know. All right, this is live, so keep in mind there's no cutting or editing right now. This is live, so I'm gonna try it. If I break it, I'm gonna be mad. <laughs> let's see. All right, let's try find. I don't know if this is right or left. Okay, this is right. So if you guys get confused, it says an R right there. R and then, you know, left right there. But let's try this one right here, right. All right. Oh, is it? Oh, oh, okay, so there's no way to choose one or the other. This finds both at the same time. So let's see what it does. I don't hear nothing. Okay, how are you supposed to hear this? I don't know if you guys can hear that. Okay, there's no way you can hear that. I thought it was gonna be like some supersonic sound or something. It's way too soft. Okay, here, you hear that, right? Okay, now watch. You can barely hear it. Okay, that's, I thought it would have been like blinding or something, like, like something real super loud or something. Like, <laughs> messed my ears up, but okay, okay, let's go into general. General is real basic. Just a manual, basically. Then, of course, you got tips. Again, just a manual, nothing good in there. Labs. Labs, I have these two checked because, you know, I do gaming. And then, again, this is another way to boost your volume up. A lot of people have been complaining, oh, it's too soft. Well, two ways to boost it. This is one of the main ways right here. You just click that, it boosts up the volume. Of course, you can just turn the volume up on your phone or on these guys. Okay, let's go back. Okay, and then about your buds, and see, I told you, super basic. That's it. That's all there is to it. Easy peasy. Okay, the only thing I didn't do yet is try it on my watch. I never tried it on my watch yet. Now, if you guys want to know how I custom made my Active Two, um, you can check out my other videos. This is the Samsung Galaxy Active Two LTE version, but it works for any of them. Let's do this real quick. So yeah, the only thing I haven't done is, but the memory on this thing sucks. You only get 1.75 gigabytes and I'm over a gigabyte already. So I'm not putting music in here. There's no way I can. And yeah, and the battery life kind of sucks on this, but these guys, I haven't tried the battery life on it yet, but these guys are awesome. Okay, there's one more thing I wanna kind of show you guys too. Okay, the irritating part is sometimes, you know, you can put them in the wrong side. You like, you know, when you just throw them in, you're in a rush, you're like trying to fit them in. That's kind of one of the only parts I don't like because it gets kind of annoying. But, you know, it's in there. But see what I mean? Okay, you see? It doesn't close, right? You know why? If you're in a rush, you leave in a gym, you gotta do something. It feels and looks like it fits exactly. But in reality, you have it on the wrong side. But that's the irritating part of me. The shape of this thing is weird. And then bam, see? But that's the irritating part. When you're in a rush or something, or you gotta leave the gym or something, you just turn them in there, you're trying to fit it in, you're like, damn, it doesn't want to go in there. But yeah, well, anyways. Okay, so last thing I wanna do, oh, and it has two microphones. So the microphone on these are pretty awesome. Like. My um, friends and my girlfriend couldn't really tell the difference if I was on a earpiece or if I sounded different or anything rather than my phone. I don't know if you guys can see that, but there's like a hole right there. That's your microphone and that's your other microphone. Microphone, microphone. Now both of them got microphones on it. So if you want to use it one by one or if you're in a conference or something, you're trying to do a meeting. Each one has um, a microphone on it. Okay, you see how this thing goes on? I don't know if you guys seen that. Okay, when you open your case, let's do it again. This is a cool feature if you're always using a phone, but uh, see what I mean? I put them in the wrong side again. That's the irritating part I don't like. But okay, right there. Okay, cool thing about this, 
if you always have your phone with you. You open it up. Does it automatically? So the case is a battery. You see it? The case is a battery. So I think the case when you charge it up, it has one full charge. So you can just put it in the case and charge it. So it already has a battery. So it's like a battery with the battery, which is pretty cool. And on top of that, if you wanted to, you could turn your phone around. Bam. You can charge them on your phone right there. You can charge it, no problem. The thing I don't like about the case, so I mean I like the case itself, is I wish there was a rubber bottom. You see how glossy this thing is? I mean, if you got it like on a table or something, it just it just falls off. You see that? But th this is rubber right here. So if it had like a rubber bottom, you can just oh it still it slides even on the rubber. Look at that. And then the rubber it slides a little bit. Let's try my face one. Okay, yeah, my face is more more rubbery than the back, but yeah, see if it was rubber, no problem, right? So I'll probably get um, a phone screen protector, and I'll probably cut it out just to put it around. Maybe I can wrap it around the whole thing and cut it out or something. Yeah, but yeah, sorry for the long video. Just excited to get these guys. I wanted one for a while. I couldn't believe how cool these things look. I mean, people do them on YouTube. It doesn't give it justice. I don't even know if you guys can see that. Here, look. It's like a beetle. It's exactly like a beetle, like the color of a beetle. And then when you turn it around, look at that. It's all mate, like a mate blue, but it blends in with that one. So there's another thing I'm gonna do. Okay, you see this rubber piece right there? Just to let you guys know, you can buy these separately anywhere. I probably might go like a yellow or something or, or like a mix it up because you can get these strips get these strips separately but I might kind of make one I'll mess around with my 3d printer I want to make like a plastic one that snaps on that has like a hole where I can put like a maybe like an 18 karat chain you know and make them connect them together so that you know you don't drop one and lose one or when you walk in or something you don't lose one or whatever but yeah I want to attach like an 18 karat chain to it or a 14 karat chain or or something anything just to attach it in the back of your head that's what I want to do. I, I'm going to mess around with the 3D printer. I'm trying to make like a plastic version, make it like a hook. Or who knows, maybe somebody already made it. Or if nobody made that yet, heads up. You know, maybe you can make some money and start, you invent that thing, guarantee people will buy it. But this heads up. All right, so, okay, let's make sure it's the right way because, like I said, that thing be irritating. All right, that's my full review. Oh, and it takes about an hour or less to charge it completely. Lasts you about eight to ten hours throughout the whole day, maybe even more. Depends how loud you blast your music. But sorry for the long review, but I'm really excited about these. Like I said, it's the complete ins and outs from it. It's, there's there's not much to it. It's just a you know headphone, and then the inside is just hard plastic. It's not metal or anything. It's hard plastic. The whole thing is basically hard plastic. But the reason why it feels heavy is because the inside part right here is actually a battery. Is a battery right here rechargeable battery for your headphones oh last thing that's the best of the best i didn't even know i just wanted to buy them a lot of you guys don't know it doesn't even say in the manual these guys are waterproof dude you can go swimming with these everything and then you can even um google it or youtube it you see guys like putting this in water overnight you see guys putting it in the wash machine you can literally swim with these it's waterproof now that that's like the icing on the icing on the cake right there because it's waterproof. The only thing I'm worried about if you swim with it, you see these things right here, and then you see that that's like a tiny indentation it goes in a little bit. It's like a sensor. So these things go in a little bit. It can trap water, and even inside here you can trap water. So if you do go swimming with it, you do get it wet. It dry these out. You got to dry it out because if you put that on a charger. These will break 110%. But I'm not even going to chant swimming in or anything in these. No, 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 no. It's my babies. All right. Definitely subscribe. I need way more subscribers. Help me out. Help me subscribe. Check it out. Check out my watch tutorial on how to turn this and turn your um, Active 2 or any smart watch into a Rolex. Um, just check out my other videos. I appreciate it. Thank you so much.